Christ is in the sea, and came to the land of the world, and the fire is in the midst of the sea, and the fire is in the midst of the sea. Christ is in the world, and the fire is in the midst of the sea, and the fire is in the midst of the sea. Those who lead us are to bring the light and the burning of the soul. God is the light that is in the light. When you go into the world, you young people, you thank you. The Creator is taking the word of the Shabbat day and to do the good. And I'm not very prepared. <laughs> you have to continue to take the truth. You walk the earth and speak to your elders and your family and all your people to so I have to do your best in your life as you walk in here. To be able to be here. How many thought I could be here? I didn't go to school till I was 17 years old. But I don't know how many people are. I had to start working when I was 9 years old. Now, I think it's all happening with all these things. People around me do the best they can to play a good view. Thank you. Thank you. 
And I know the people that work behind the scenes and work part of this week for the last 13 years, most of whom are invisible, who make sure that your toilets are flushing and your lights are on, your buses are running, and that the schools are running well, and your teachers are paid so that they can continue to do the work that they love to bring you to this point today. Um, the only reason we exist is today. And so I thank you for making my job easy and worthwhile. Um, and we welcome the opportunity for you as you take what you have learned and spread out into the world and return back and let you go and come back. And uh, as we become educators and psychologists and doctors and lawyers and tradesmen and people who have learned lessons just through living life, we welcome you back. And to these people, our colleagues, we know we've done well. Um, so we have a vision of a community where all are respected and each person is developed to be there to develop their potential. And our motto is dream, believe, achieve. And you have done that today. You dreamed it, you believed it, you achieved it, and we also believed in you. The values of trust and respect, personal growth, equity, being inclusive, nurturing, meaningful relationships, to community and collaboration, supporting every journey. And no matter what your future holds, we know we will continue to represent our school district and principals in secondary school in the most positive way. And we look future, we look forward to the future where you are colleagues, leaders of friends, conditions graduates of the class of 2023, young men to counsel. Thank you. Solutions are not found 
by doing the same old things over and over. So, class of 2023, the world eagerly awaits your contributions. May each of you embark on this journey with grit, curiosity, and an unwavering belief in your ability to create a more beautiful world. Congratulations.
folks that have been raised today. I have registered for the building employment skills training certificate program at OC. Congratulations. Third, it's looking forward to pursuing a career in psychology at UBC. She would like to thank everyone who has helped her to get to this point. At this time, I would like to call upon Colin Clark, her dad, to present the Professional Firefighters Association.
But we would like to thank all the teachers, friends, folks behind this director and his We would especially like to thank my mom and sister, the homes of the for her in Canada for the past two years. I want to congratulate all the parents. Thank you to the whole family. Congratulations. Thank you, President. Thank you, President, for thank his friends and family for helping him push through the last five years. Thank you, President, for getting into the real world and explore the possibilities of knowledge, entrepreneurship, and e commerce. Congratulations.
the Greater Berlin Minor Basketball Association, and the Greater Berlin Alumni Basketball Association. Thank you. 
would like to thank all the teachers and Mrs. Myers for helping with her team as well. Sarah would also like to thank her parents, aunt, uncle, and grandparents for supporting her. Earlier this year, Sarah received a dual credit tuition sponsorship from the school district and is completing a heavy mechanical foundation program at Okanagan College in Florida. Congratulations to her. I would like to thank her mom and dad for all their love and involvement throughout the years. She's also grateful for her outstanding teachers and friends who provided their support. I was excited to pursue her Bachelor of Arts at the University of British Columbia in Okanagan in the fall. At this time, I would like to call upon Connor Pugnall to present the Clarence School Leadership Award. She is the last sibling in her family. 
things that these years have done to them. Congratulations. This time, I'm going to call upon Aaron Shorter to present the AWS Call to Law. Congratulations. Kristen Black.
the recipient of this year's Larry Gross Principals Award is Anderson Matt. <laughs> Some of you are going to college and university, some of you are 
some of them are bad, and some of us have no fun at all. And all of these things are great. I feel like we're all stressed about the future and the friends that we don't have and that are expected of us. But guys, we spent the past five years of stressing on homework, tests, even just passing in class. Let's take a deep breath and not stress your lungs about the future. You're going to be okay. Today, it's important to follow the software. Take the time to set the to run it and appreciate all the things that you need. Enjoy spending time with the kids that are in fifth, kindergarten, or middle school. I know this sounds cheesy, but let's really cherish this day. This is literally the last day that we'll be surrounded by all of our friends and classmates. Some people you're sitting beside right now, you may never see again. One thing that I'm sure is that mind is the period of the only step of the premises to do that. The thing is, you're not going to waste your best friends, because you'll make it better to stay in front of them. The people who lived in a place that went to be my kind of approaches, and they still made my school just a little bit more comfortable. You're going to miss the kid who smiles, something you would pass in the hallway, the person who forces you next to your class, the smart kid who let you cheat off of your test, and the kid who found the tightrope that got away too much of the good guy who treated the guy who got dropped on his head at the point where I did nothing. And the girl who ran down the rusty dam and got her from me to get the most back for nothing. That one thing in class I was able to share. The kids in younger grades who somehow got them. The kid who always wore a suit and taught that to English. You could have been sitting with false things anywhere, but it was on the couches in the ground now, which were on the gym floor. You're going to miss the coaches who must be the best for their team on and off. The teachers who brought you to the safe place. The drama teacher who brought you out of your comfort zone. And the crazy math teacher who tried to grab a banana to get out of the final exam. Listen, fancy teachers can help you take a song today. Don't get me wrong, today is really cool that is where we are right now. But at the end of the day, we did this ourselves. We can all take part in that. You were the one who pushed yourself and showed up. You came to class with felt like you couldn't. You all went to bed with no sleep. You stayed up late. So, congratulations and good job on your class of 2023.